gun to my head, I will take tea. I, I don't drink coffee at all. Je le déteste. Neither. I don't drink wine. Full stop. I don't drink much at all when it comes to alcohol. I would probably go for Harlem simply because I live in Manhattan and Harlem is in Upper Manhattan. Hitchcock. No contest. If you watch Hitchcock's Shadow of a Doubt, you are treated to a really warm movie, a movie with emotional depth and range. I can't think of a single Kubrick film that engages the heart. Oh, Amy Adams, I would have to say. She nails it every single time and she seems to be a different person every single time. I think she's, she's an extraordinary actress. Rear Window is one of my favorite movies and if you haven't seen it, I urge you to do so. It is so funny, it is so clever, and it's genuinely suspenseful. Oh, meat, my gosh, I, oh, I could never ever be vegan. Instagram I like because it requires minimal commentary. I'm giving you a picture. You don't need any text from me. Both. It's tough to choose, both. Oh, French Bulldog. They make me laugh. They are so ugly and I find them very attachant. I'm going to say neither. My murder weapon of choice would be poison. I find poison absolutely fascinating. Watch, it's classic. Yeah, watch. I'm a morning person, but I write in the afternoons. <laughs> That's a really good question. Probably a window. A window can be evocative. And also, of course, you can see through a window, so there's, there's more to enjoy, more to appreciate. Although I do love an old-fashioned door. <laughs> well, I've got to choose Tina, don't I? Although I will be naming my French bulldog Ike. Um, Georges Simenon, because he was le maître. And th they're actually quite different, aren't they? Because Georges Simenon wrote Policier, and Harlan Coben is writing Polar. And because they're different, I'm going to say both.